My name is Alan Lawson. I'm one of the partners here, one of the owners here at Bocage Crawfish. Bocage Crawfish was formed as a partnership between three rice and crawfish farmers. We were looking for something to do with the crawfish on our farms that weren't marketable crawfish that were restaurant quality. When we got together and we built this peeling business where we peel and process crawfish, tail meat, and it's grown into a little bit more. Our product line has expanded. We do whole cook. We do a few other things. We were looking for a better way to label our production. Michelle sells Epson printers and we can print on an as-needed basis our labels with a lot number and a best buy date and we can print just the amount we need so we don't waste any. We can do it in-house, we can do custom labeling if, if the need arises, if it arises, if a customer is interested in a, in, a, in a custom label or some production that we do for them or uh, we can do that in-house. So they send us the artwork and we can put it onto a label for them and we can do it quickly. We have a, a linear scale that we use for packaging whole cooked crawfish. We were having trouble with keeping it calibrated and it was burning out load cells. And once once Anthony looked at it, he realized it's not the it wasn't the right load cell and we got it changed out to where it's now the calibration's right, it's it's running up to the capacity that it was designed to do. That machine has mechanized the packing process and we, what used to take us numerous people, probably 10 people to do, we can do with two or three now. And we can do more production with less labor. We can go in the back and, and see what we do here. but you want them cool enough. The ice helps keep the humidity and the moisture in the air so it keeps them dry. This is probably could go in the whole cook sauce. Then you'll have the little ones that get you know, quite naturally there's, there's different sizes as they as they grow.
This is our first full year of production. We started last year late with uh, minimal workforce. This year we got a full workforce and we got a full season. So we've, uh, we've learned a lot of things along the way and I think we have a lot left to learn.